lot of times when you run a best practice analyzer or you go through a course and it says, oh, by the way, you have to change the binding order, they recommend that you have a certain network adapter at the top of the binding order. And in this case, with Exchange, you'd want to have the client network adapter, the one that's going to communicate with the clients, as the first network adapter in a binding order. And, you know, how do you find it? So let me show you. We're going to go out into our control panel here. So I'll fire off my machine here. And this is for Windows Server 2012. Your uh, mileage may vary, so depending upon what operating system you have. So we go into Network and Internet. We go into Network and Sharing. Then what we're going to do is we're going to get into Change Adapter Settings. And this is, you know, fairly reasonable. Now I only have one, but even if I had multiples, if I went into the properties of this uh, particular network connection, uh, I don't see anything with binding order. I'm thinking, now I'm using a Hyper-V, but it doesn't matter. I could go into Configure, and inside Configure, I don't see anything with a binding order in here at all. This is the advanced properties and the configuration properties for that particular network adapter. So it's tucked away, so how do I do it? Well, um, it's kind of odd, but what you want to do is inside of this interface, you want to hit the Advanced button. I don't see an Advanced button, so what you do is you hit Alt, and when you hit Alt, then you have an Advanced button. You click on the Advanced button, you go into Advanced Settings, and this is where you can change the binding order. Now, right now, I only have one network adapter, and it's helpfully called Ethernet. But if I had multiple network adapters in here, I would want to label them Ethernet 1, Ethernet 2, Ethernet 3, Ethernet 4. And what you want to do is, is change the binding order here. That way, depending upon what product you're running and what service you're trying to do, the, uh, the binding order will be correct for you. And again, Best Practice Analyzer will tell you which one. And it's also a good idea to name your network adapters. That way you know which one should be on top.